When it comes to behemoths at sea, most people will think of an aircraft carrier in their minds. Indeed, in the military, the aircraft carrier is undoubtedly the largest maritime equipment. However, there is a kind of ship that is several times larger than an aircraft carrier. This kind of ship is an oil tanker. As a marine tool for transporting oil and other energy sources, the bigger the tanker is, the lower the transportation cost will be. Therefore, when many countries build oil tankers, they often pursue huge volumes. There is a tanker called Seawise Giant, which is the largest ship in human history. With a deadweight capacity of an astonishing 650,000 tons, it's the Guinness Discipline Holder in deadweight tonnage. The most amazing thing is its length. Its total length is 458.45 meters, which is longer than the lying down Eiffel Tower. However, although this ship has many honors, it has a very short and hard life. After four times of renaming and five transfers, it still cannot escape the fate of being dismantled. In today's video, let's talk about the largest ship in the world. Okay, let's get started. Currently the largest cruise ship in the world is Harmony of the Seas, built by STX France and owned by Royal Caribbean Cruises Limited. The cruise ship Harmony of the Seas is 361 meters long, about 50 meters longer than the Eiffel Tower in France, about 66 meters wide, it is the widest cruise ship so far. Since the start of construction in September 2013, the STX French shipyard has employed 2,500 people and spent 10 million man-hours to build this behemoth. Harmony of the Seas has 18 decks, is about 362 meters long, about 64 meters high, and has a passenger capacity of 6,000 people. It cost a total of 800 million pounds to build. Harmony of the Seas is 100 meters longer than the famous Titanic in history. There are many facilities on the Harmony of the Seas, including golf courses, theaters, a restoration of Central Park in New York, and more. Because it is a luxury cruise ship, the space provided to passengers on Harmony of the Seas is far less cramped than that of Navy sailors, and it is not an exaggeration to call it a palace at sea. The Harmony of the Seas is already a human wonder, but in terms of tonnage, the largest container ship in the world is heavier than the Harmony of the Seas. This is the 24000 TEU oceangoing container ship built by China State Shipbuilding Corporation, with a displacement of nearly 300,000 tons. The maximum height of this domestic giant ship has reached 76 meters, which is equivalent to a 25-story building, and the total deck area is as high as 24,000 square meters, which is equivalent to 3.5 standard football fields. What's more, the ship can carry 240,000 tons of cargo at one time, ranking first among similar ships. However, compared with the largest ship in the world we are going to talk about today, the two big ships mentioned above are somewhat dwarfed in terms of displacement and tonnage. The largest ship in the history of human shipbuilding, with an unprecedented displacement of 820,000 tons, was designed to transport oil. It is said that it can load 4.1 million barrels of oil at a time, enough to supply the oil consumption of India's 1.5 billion people for one day. The Seawise Giant was not originally called this name, but was called Apama, which is the name of the place where the ship is located. It was built by Sumitomo Heavy Industries of Japan in 1979. The ship was ordered by a Greek energy businessman, and his request to Japanese engineers was also very simple that is, to build the largest oil tanker in the world. Later, the ship was put on hold because the standard of the ship did not meet the requirements of the Greek company, and then the Greek company went bankrupt before the ship was completed, and the Japanese had to look for a buyer again. So the ship passed into the hands of Hong Kong ship owner Dong Haiyun, who renamed it Seawise Giant and became a huge ship belonging to the Chinese. Dong Haiyun is the founder of Orient Overseas Container Line, and has an extremely important position in the world shipping industry. In 1940, Dong Haoyun established China Shipping. At its peak, it had a fleet of over 150 freighters with a load capacity of more than 10 million tons. It was known as the Onassis of the East and one of the seven largest ship kings in the world. By the way, he also has a more famous son, former Hong Kong chief executive Tung Chiwa. 
After Dong Haoyun took over the Sea Weiss giant in 1979, he immediately put it into crude oil transportation. However, due to the relatively thin structure of the hull, many difficulties appeared in the operation process, so he had to make large scale changes again. In the end, the displacement of the sea giant was increased to 820,000 tons. Don't forget that this is the shipbuilding technology of the 1980s. Therefore, the Seawise giant is indeed a technical madness of the human shipbuilding industry. After the Seawise giant was put into use, although it cost a lot, because it far exceeded the loading capacity of ordinary tankers, the Seawise giant soon began to make profits and gradually became one of the most famous tankers in the world. The oil supply of countless countries depends on the Seawise giant to complete. Regrettably, the Seawise giant also failed to escape the curse of the giant ship. The so-called curse of the giant ship is that most of the ships that have been named the largest in human history have not ended well. The Titanic is one of the famous examples, and the Japanese Yamato-class battleship during World War II was also one of the victims. After the outbreak of the Iran-Iraq War, the Strait of Hormuz was blocked by Iraqi anti-ship missiles, but the Seawise giant still ventured into the Persian Gulf at such a tense moment. However, Iraqi warplanes fired two flying fish anti-ship missiles at the giant ship. Eventually, she sank in shallow waters off the coast of Karg Island, Iran. Due to the shallow waters, part of the hull of the Seawise giant was left exposed on the surface. Later, this Seawise giant has been sleeping in the waters off the coast of Karg Island until the end of the Iran-Iraq War. The ship was salvaged and sold to Norman International, a joint private equity fund in Norway. The Keppel shipyard in Singapore was refurbished, and the entire maintenance process consumed 3,200 tons of steel raw materials, totaling a cost of 60 million US dollars. Afterwards, the Seawise giant was renamed Happy Giant and launched into operation. However, it didn't take long for the ship to change its owner and be renamed the Jarl Viking. More than 10 years later, it was resold to the first Orson Tanker Company and renamed the Knock Nevis. It will also be converted to store and offload crude oil in Dubai Dry Dock. Five years later, the ship was sold to Indian shipbreakers for dismantling. The Seawise Giant is a wonder in the history of world shipbuilding, a giant ship belonging to the East, and its world record has not been broken so far. In 2010, this Seawise Giant, which had been away from the East for 29 years, finally set foot on its homeland again. Its 36-ton anchor is used as an exhibition in the Hong Kong Maritime Museum. In the past 29 years, the oil tanker Seawise Giant has changed its name four times, refurbished three times, and ran aground once, and returned to the embrace of the East. Well, thanks for listening. If you have any suggestions, just leave them in the comments section. We'll come back as soon as possible and check them, and then we'll give feedback. See you next time.